School was my happy place, and so I never wanted to leave. I became a teacher because I wanted everyone else to feel the same way about school. Hands-on and interactive learning is really important because children are doers. They're very creative. They have the most wonderful imaginations and they haven't learned to put those away. So when you learn something that's hands-on and you really interact with what you're doing, you own it. A good example of taking something to the next level would be like when my students study butterflies. We start with a book share and we learn about the body parts of a butterfly. And then we learn a song and we sing it and we have hand motions. And so we put into, we have music and we have muscle memory to help us remember those. And then we go ahead and we build models. We make its body with our hands. And when we build it, after we've read about it and sung about it and danced about it, we can't help but remember what we've learned. I've always had a saying over the last few decades that I've been teaching, and that's when you're one of Mrs. Gray's kids, you're always one of Mrs. Gray's kids. I don't stop caring about them once they walk out my classroom door. I always look for all of their, their victories and things that happen to them in the future. What I want most for my students to know is how much I cared for them, I prayed for them, dreamed big dreams for them. I want them to leave feeling like I was their biggest cheerleader and that I helped them take those chances and those risks while they learned. Um, I want them to leave my classroom thirsting for knowledge and being brave enough to go out and seek it. I am really looking forward to working with WIPB through the Early Learning Champions to learn more about different strategies and ways that I can reach my students. Working with more people in the community, getting to network and know my community members better in hopes of reaching even more children beyond my classroom. Nothing makes my heart more happy or my soul sing louder than watching a child learn. When a child learns something new and they own it and they're excited about it, it's like watching a small miracle in your classroom and I'm lucky every day to get to be a part of that.